Hey there, Wade here with the Betts team at Guardian Mortgage. Just wanted to again thank you for your business and trust. If you're seeing this, you have asked some questions around how escrow accounts work. So I just want to kind of give you a high level explanation. And if it raises any additional questions, by all means, let me know. So uh, I'm going to go over both purchase and refinance escrow accounts in this because they're a little bit different. So on a purchase loan, typically we're collecting two months of insurance and three months of property taxes. There are some exceptions to that, but that's generally what, what happens. The reason being is at closing on a purchase, you're going to have the first year's homeowner's insurance premium that gets paid by the title company directly to the insurance carrier at closing. So that covers the first year of homeownership. Then we have the two months that are in the escrow account to start with because you're only going to make 10 mortgage payments to us until that next annual homeowner's insurance bill is due. So we have to start off with the two months so you can add the 10 months that amounts to 12 months and we can pay the annual uh, uh, insurance bill uh, this time next year so taxes are a little bit different because it's required to have a cushion in there so i said three months and that's just an approximate number but the reality is about one month covers the uh, month that you're skipping with your monthly payment and then you have a two month cushion uh, in there as well because property taxes change the most year over year so escrow accounts are always a little bit padded so there's some exceptions to that. If you're buying new construction, it can get kind of quirky with uh, uh, the property tax credit from the seller. Uh, if, uh, if it's the, the end of the year where the tax bills are out, it kind of does something funky to the number of months needed. But at the end of the day, the end result is the same. You're only paying for what you owe the first year of ownership, and then it uh, all pans out year two beyond. So that's purchase. Refinances are a little bit different because they are totally predicated on when for insurance when your annual policy renews so how many months have to go into escrow account uh, depends on when your policy will renew and then uh, the property taxes the number of months to collect there uh, are totally predicated on when the bill is, is due so uh, all of those are outside of our control uh, but it's a very simple formula to, to calculate so if you have questions about uh, specifics for your case let us know my team and I are happy to walk you through the particulars and again, thank you so much for your business and trust, and we're looking forward to taking great, great care of you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.